General Omar Bradley was no ordinary general. He achieved his rank on the battlefields of North Africa, Sicily, and Europe. During the harsh winter days of the Allied offensive in Europe, when the survival of the free world lay in his hands, the mobility and firepower he always counted on proved to be the edge that brought ultimate victory. Today, the Bradley Fighting Vehicle System takes mobility and firepower a leap forward, giving the United States Army a combined arms team. Developed and built for the United States Army by FMC Corporation, this single weapon system constructed of aluminum and steel armor is configured for either infantry or cavalry missions. The M2 Infantry Fighting Vehicle carries a commander and gunner and the two-man turret, a driver, and seven squad members. Identical in appearance, the M3 cavalry fighting vehicle carries a commander and gunner in the two-man turret, a driver, and two scouts. The additional space accommodates a greater complement of ammunition. Working in combination with the Abrams main battle tank, artillery, and the attack helicopter, the Bradley significantly reduces the advantages of the enemy's numerical superiority. The primary weapon, an awesome 25mm cannon by Hughes helicopter, fires both armor-piercing and high-explosive fire at rates of up to 200 rounds per minute. A coaxially mounted 7.62mm machine gun provides effective anti-personnel fire for close-in engagements. The all-electric turret drive and stabilization system by General Electric allows the cannon and machine gun to fire with accuracy even when the vehicle is moving at speed over rough terrain. Gunner, truck, 1200 meters, AG. Push-button controls located between the gunner and commander allow instant change of ammunition type and firing rate. Elevation, depression, slew, and firing are all combined in a single control, so the gunner can focus his attention on target engagement. A second set of controls on the commander's side provide him with an override capability. The integrated sight unit by Hughes Aircraft enables the Bradley to detect enemy targets through heat differential. The system is so sensitive it can see through smoke screens, camouflage, and even sparsely wooded areas. To support the main battle tank in combined ground gaining offensive combat, the Bradley can destroy opposing tanks. This is the first armored fighting vehicle equipped with a proven long-range tow anti-tank missile. Tank, 3,000 meters. One switch automatically raises and synchronizes the armored twin tube launcher. The tow anti-tank missile is effective against armor at ranges in excess of 3,000 meters. To keep pace,
face with the main battle, move troops rapidly and for its own survivability, Bradley has outstanding mobility. Mobility that results from an optimum combination of engine power, powertrain efficiency, and suspension. The commercially proven Cummins 500 horsepower turbocharged diesel engine delivers rapid acceleration and battlefield agility. The hydromechanical transmission by General Electric combines steering, braking, and gear selection as a single unit, resulting in outstanding maneuverability. and the capacity to climb slopes of up to 60%. The suspension system with 14 inches of vertical wheel travel and high performance shock absorbers carries the vehicle over rough terrain with minimum shock and stress to troops and vehicle. The Bradley has maximum armor protection for minimum weight by using the FMC Spaced Laminate Armor System. This protects the squad against the majority of weapons encountered. Reloading of the externally mounted missile launcher is accomplished under armor by the loader without leaving the vehicle. Unlike the BMP, the Bradley is human engineered with the soldier in mind. Personnel and equipment positions assure adequate space for troops to perform with maximum effectiveness even after long hours of vehicle confinement. During mounted operations, six vision blocks and firing ports to the sides and rear of the M2 give squad members the capability to see targets and engage them with their 5.56 millimeter automatic weapons. Many combat tasks can only be accomplished by dismounted infantrymen. Squad, prepare to dismount. Prepare to dismount. The Bradley M2 infantry fighting vehicle brings troops to the main battle area with the option of fighting mounted or dismounted. Under the protection of terrain, the lead squads maneuver ahead of their vehicles. Their objective, an anti-tank position 400 meters ahead. Following a terrain feature for protection, the vehicles move into position to provide fire support for the dismounted troops as they perform their traditional infantry tasks. With the ability to move forward at speed, under attack, in the combat area, the Bradley M2 has transformed the infantry squad from a team of riflemen to a well-armed fighting unit, capable of effective operation on the mechanized battlefield. Firepower, mobility, and survivability make a potent weapon system.
Operating on the mechanized battlefield with the Abrams main battle tank, artillery, and the attack helicopters, the Bradley fighting vehicle guarantees the United States Army has a combined arms team that is second to none.